guys. Um, I'm sorry I wasn't in the last week's video. I st did still manage to get an update up, but I was so ill. I just um, I went to last Tuesday's weigh, weigh in, and uh, from about six o'clock I started to get a sore throat, and then by nine o'clock I was down with flu. I was hot and cold, shivers, temperature. I was in bed for like three days. I just could, I was sleeping the whole time, just hot temperature over 100 for three days, and then finally it came down. And now I feel like I've just got a cold, so I'm able to carry on, you know, normal daily things like normal, but you know, having to blow my nose a few times and a bit of a cough at night. But apart from that, I'm definitely getting better. Um, I still haven't uh, spoken to the doctors about my blood results yet um, in regards to everything else. I did speak to them and they said that my B, my vitamin B12 was normal but my they needed to talk to me about vitamin D. So um, I haven't made an appointment yet so I need to speak to them about that. And um, I don't know if there's anything with my thyroid. So um, yeah, no update on that yet. Um, but I have cut out all sweeteners just in case it was that causing me to feel awful and I mean it's difficult to tell if that side of things better yet because of having the flu and still feeling like really run down from that so I don't know it's difficult to tell which is which really but I think I'm 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 getting better anyway either way um so last week, um, I'm looking at my journal, I've actually started using the um, phone app uh, a lot more now instead of using this and I, but actually I really do like this. So um, I find the app really irritating, like it doesn't, th since they updated it and made it better to use it's actually become even more annoying to use because the foods that I use all the time aren't saved anymore and it's just really irritating so unless there's something wrong with my app but I actually prefer this because you have to spend like 10 minutes searching through the food and you know what it is and you know how many points it is but you still have to spend ages finding it and putting it in whereas with this I know if I know what it is I just write it down it takes two seconds so I, I want to try and go back to using this again so it was only for last week anyway, which, to be honest, I didn't eat very much anyway. So um, last Tuesday is when I started to feel ill. I had 35 points, so I did go over, um, I can't remember what I had for my treat meal now. Because it's not written in my book, it's in my app and I'm using my phone camera, so I can't tell you. Um, but then the next day I only had 17 points um, and that was just because I was just felt so nauseous and also didn't feel very hungry uh, and I was asleep pretty much the whole day so um, yeah I just had like very, something like very plain I'll add some pictures in um, as well uh, of my meals because uh, comments last week said that they really like people like showing show, ugh people enjoyed seeing the meals that I cooked so um, if you're not on Instagram because I do that like every day anyway if, if you do want to go to Instagram um, my username's the same amyjane1406 go on there and then I post pretty much every day at least one meal um, that I'm having so and usually it comes with the points as well um, so if you are interested in that um, join that as well um, but anyway yeah I'll put some pictures in so don't Day two was last Wednesday and I only had 17 points. Day three, which is Thursday, I had 23. Then day four, I only had 15 points. Um, day five, I was starting to feel better because I had 30 points. Day six, I had uh, 27 and then day seven, which was last Monday, I had 39 points. And I don't know what it was, but um, last Monday, which is the day before weigh-in, so usually I try and eat like quite low amounts, just to, you know, not to have big pig out, but I, it, I had a hungry day. And I don't know if you ever have a hungry day, but you are just hungry all the time. And it's not like you want snacks or you're craving sugar, it's just you are hungry. So I was so hungry, I had like a big lunch, I think I had chilli, um, and then 
uh, yeah, I'll put a picture. And then for dinner, I had homemade burgers, chips and salad. And I didn't put that on Instagram because I felt really guilty <laughs> of having like a huge lunch and then a huge dinner as well. So, but I'll put, I did take a picture of it, so I'll put that in here. Anyway, so I went to Weight Watchers on t this Tuesday and um, it was the first time I'd been out of the house since I'd been to Weight Watchers the week before. So it was quite nice to get out even though it's absolutely freezing and it's just started snowing here again. Um, and I lost two and a half pounds. So I was quite happy with that. I kn I'd weighed myself midweek and I'd lost five pounds but obviously that was because I wasn't eating anything or hardly anything. So... Um, Obviously, once I started eating again, I had to put a couple back on. But two and a half pounds, still a good loss for this week. And um, I'm really happy because I noticed, I realised that the whole, since I started my weight loss journey in January, sort of again, I have had a loss every single week. And I'm really happy with that. So total loss this year is nine pounds. And total lost um, since joining Weight Watchers is, is 47. So I'm nearly back to my 50 pounds loss where um, I got my certificate. Um, I don't know if you can see it. Hang on, let me. It's stuck there on my wardrobe. <laughs> I stuck my certificate on my wardrobe. So uh, it'd be good to actually get there and feel like I did actually earn it because I got to 50 pounds and then I just went straight back up again. So, or yeah, lost, uh, put loads back on. So yeah. Um, I think my main goal this week was to try and go to the gym, but I just feel, I don't feel 100% yet, and I keep coughing and sneezing and blowing my nose and everything, and I don't think it would be a good idea to go to the gym. Um, I thought, well, like, just go for a cycle or something, but literally, it, I don't feel better. Like, when I wake up, I feel awful, and it's not till, sort of, I'm about to go to bed that I feel fine and then I've you know so hopefully in a couple of days um I will be feeling better and we'll be able to go to the gym because I realized I have not been to the gym since last July and I was like oh my goodness I have been paying for that and I have not been once well maybe once since then maybe a couple of times since then but not regularly and I'm thinking oh my goodness what I'm one what a waste of money and two you know, I could be getting so much fitter, and I've noticed that, um, you know, oh, I said last week, uh, or the week before, I bought a size, uh, 16 pair of jeans, that's UK 16, um, and, uh, I was so happy, and then, but then when I look at myself, I'm, like, all jiggly, like, all my skin's kind of, like, hanging, and it's just not nice, so I know I'm losing weight, but my shape's not changing, and it's kind of, I know if I don't start exercising soon that I'm going to just get left with like loads of excess skin, so I really need to start toning up, I need to make it a priority, and also obviously it help with the weight loss, but um, you know, at the end of the day, once I get to goal, I want to have a nice body, I don't want to get to goal and just like still have to wear big baggy clothes because of all the skin that's left, so definitely need to make the gym a priority this week and um, uh, my sister comes home on Friday for half term so she's going to be home for a week and um, I'll be doing lots of things with her so that should keep me motivated um, to be active as well. Um, I think that's about it, can't think of anything else. Um, yeah so uh, my phone just rang. Anyway, um, yeah, I think that's about it for this week's update. Um, if you like the uh, me adding photos, um, please comment and I'll try and do that more. And I was thinking I might, if I do start going to the gym, I might add a bit of extra footage during the week or if I cook something or just to make it a bit more interesting because I know talking head um, can be a bit boring. So I'll try and live with it up a bit. Any suggestions, welcome. Um, yeah, that's it. Uh, like my Facebook page because I update there every day and also on Instagram if you want to see what meals I'm having and um, I'm on Twitter as well and I also have a blog but I haven't updated that in a while so that will be my new project 
as well to do my new blog to update it all and add some photos and everything on there so once that's all new and fresh I will uh, let you guys know um, but the link is below if you want to check it out anyway but that's all my old weight loss anyway that's it from me and I'll see you guys next week bye <laughs>